can I take your order? [laughs] Yeah, I already closed this place down until I'm eighteen. You don't wanna take over the living room, do you? There's some really special dishes there. [noise] I can't, I'm sorry. I'm the only one here and I could um I could lose my job. [laughs] Okay, well thanks to you everyone in school has this on their computer. [inaudible 1:53:46.62] And having to steal half the grocery stuff so they can make it back to you and it's only fair. If they had to do that. Well, it wa- wasn't like they were stealing from like a safety deposit box or anything like that. No, it was like safe. Safe was fine. They they took it from like a safety deposit box and then they were like, "Oh, thanks, thanks for hiding the bag." Yeah, but you didn't ha- you didn't have to ha- you didn't have to hide it. It's easy to take it out. Don't worry about it. Okay. You really wanna make things worse for yourself, don't you? [laughs] Good truck, you're gonna have a lot of trouble getting through. Oh okay, look. This has nothing to do with patty. You n- you know that, okay? It was way deeper than that. Come on. Shut up, Bryce. I don't wanna talk about that. Your mother could have said no to my father. I mean she could've stayed married to your father, but she chose not to. I had nothing to do with it. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Hey. This happened to me, too. I mean, come on. We were practically brothers, for Christ's sake. And in family, you don't treat each other this way. You ever watch Dr. Phil? It's exactly how they treat each other. You [inaudible 1:54:04.05] Your mother did it. Yeah, exactly. That's what you wanna do. Unless it's like, saying something about your bum and then you're like sticking it to your bum. [laughs] Cool. Take this. Oh, I can't believe you got away with that. [laughs] I know you can't believe the shit you pulled. [laughs] Stop it. [laughs] I'm sorry, guys. Oh, yeah, we should just go down to the States. What the heck? Why would you do that? [laughs] Cuz we're going to Vegas. Yeah, that's why. [laughs] Yeah, that's right. We should go to Vegas. [laughs] Yeah, we should. [noise] Maybe the food will like distract me. I think Game of Thrones will distract me. You think so, huh? Dude, your mom will love Game of Thrones. She's not gonna watch it with you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I think you're gonna like lose your mind. Good job, Susie. Bye. You're gonna stay there for the whole time. Yeah. [laughs] Yeah, probably. Can you pass that? Oh, Susie. Do you remember that one time I dunno, I was drinking like tea or something? Fuck! Yeah, Susie was drinking. I'm pretty sure it was Jimmy Jimmy. Yeah. Yeah, Jimmy was too. I love Jimmy. Can I have some, please? I I've had enough of this. They're going to hate me. [laughs] No! [inaudible 1:55:49.16] No! Jimmy! Jimmy! Yes! 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 Do you know where the steak spice is? No. Yeah. Sure, it's there. Heard it's really good. I'll be going to Vegas. Yeah, I can't wait. [laughs] Can you take your mask off? Yeah, I can't wait to go back. You can't take it off. Yeah. Yeah, take it off. Cuz it's gonna be hot. Yeah, that's right. Make sure you wear a mask. I have it! And I have it! Oh, I thought you had it all the time, actually. No, I have it hidden under my desk. Oh, okay. No no, it's fine. It's fine. I just can't see it when I drive. It's like the car thing? Oh wait, no. It's not that one. It's the other one. No, it's not this one. It's the other one. No. Oh, wait, no. Sorry. There's another one. Yeah, but this one's just as [inaudible 1:56:42.29] Yeah, this one's better. I like this one. Is that the one I thought it was gonna be? [laughs] Paul No. Oh, yeah, that one. Which one is it? Oh, that's kinda different. Is it beeping cuz I'm by the door? Hmm? No, it's cuz this is sticking out. Yeah, that's right. Do you need it for cutting, or you need it for like, doing it? Yeah, just need it for the moment. I'll just stand back while you're doing that. Oh, okay. [laughs] Yeah, I don't think we need this on the record, either. No, no, it's all good. Did you put the garlic on it, Mat? No, I'll wait. No, we don't need to put the garlic. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, just uh, just keep it on the b- keep, just keep it on the boil. It'll be, it'll cook evenly, right? Oh yeah. Cool. I can do that. Then when it's all wet and stuff you just Put it on. Yeah, I'm gonna rinse it afterwards, so Yeah. Um, where's your garlic, Ibs? Can you keep it on the boil? Okay, I'll cut around that maybe. Yeah, I don't think we need to peel that. [inaudible 1:57:09.71] Oh, come on. You wanna, you wanna coat some of that, maybe? With garlic? Wanna coat some of those? Cuz then we can throw those garlic seeds in there. K. Uh how's it, Ibs? Can you, is it like sticky? No. It isn't? Is it just me, then? Yeah, cuz your garlic is gonna be burnt. If I cook it for too long afterwards. How high do you want the l- the thing to be? Uh, let's go max. Isn't that too high? Hmm? That ain't too high? Uh, I'll cut it at about three seventy five. Okay. Two hundred? Two hundred and fifty. Yeah. All right. Two hundred? Where's the lemon? In the fridge. Do you want lemon? Lemon? Where's the lemon? In the fridge. Do you have a lemon squeezer? At the bottom. You don't need a squeezer. Do you have one? Yeah, you should use one. You should. I'm not a need. Yeah, I have one. But I need one for like um cooking stuff. Oh yeah. Oh, no, like Chinese steak steaks and stuff. Yeah, you need a lemon squeezer. Do you have one? Yeah, right there. There's one on the counter there. I can eat it. [laughs] He's pulling it out. Yeah, it's right there. [laughs] Thanks, babe. I'll just take it over there so it's not- Mkay. [noise] Yeah. Just leave the potatoes until like six or nine minutes Can I use this for the potatoes? [noise] Can I use this? For the potatoes? Um. Yeah. I don't have any more bowls, cuz that- that's being used by the tomatoes. Okay, yeah sure. They should all be medium rare. Well I was gonna... No, no, they're fine. I think we're fine. I think we're good. I think we're good. [noise] Uh, I could use a fork. Should I use a fork? Oh, you're you you massacred that potato. So it says cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This one? Yeah, you were supposed to keep the form. Hey, it says That one I fucked up. cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This one? Yeah. You were supposed to keep the form. Hey, what do you mean? Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This one? Yeah, you were supposed to keep the form. What do you mean? Cut across the top of the potato. So this would've been a perfect time to cook it. Except for this part. Cut across the top of the potato. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the potato. What do you mean? This part? This part. Cut across the top of the pot
Yeah, literally, I do know, yes. And if you are in any kind of... Well, of course they do. Okay, but you don't seem very happy. Happy? How could I be happy? (laughs) This... Okay, this isn't easy for me, Alex, so could you at least be polite? Well, you think it's been easy for me? I mean, you have no idea what I've been going through. No more than me, I'm sure. Do I what? Do you want me? Do you want to be with me? <sighs> Alex, dude, I've been in love with you ever since you were, were little. I mean, I used to hate going to the morgue after school. Well, that's not hard to believe. <laughs> Alex, okay, I hated it because it meant I couldn't see you. I couldn't, and you get home and I, I, I would run upstairs and come straight, straight up and look in your window and I would just, I'd watch you do your homework. Okay, wow, I I don't know what to say. And then on the days that you had to pick up a body, I mean, that was out of torture. I mean, again, it's understandable. <laughs> See, that meant I had to wait until after dinner to see you, but I, I'm done hiding my feelings, and I, I cannot go another day without telling you, without... Shh. Okay, uh, I, I'm sorry, okay. I'm sorry. This, this, this really is not what I thought we were going to be talking about. Please, just answer, please. Well, Lily, for years I have been ignoring you. Okay, and that doesn't matter. Well, no, but if I took advantage now, because you all of a sudden look you know, the way you Men do. Men are visual creatures. I understand that, Alex. It's fine. It's really, I'm okay Lily, with that. I have been doing a lot of things wrong lately, okay? I have to try to do something that's right. And Alex. that a... Oh. Please don't. Oh my god, it's killing me. Oh, I can't see it coming up in conversation. Oh god, I can't. There's, a, there's just too many things. Things about me that would make you hate me. Yeah, I can never hate you. You could. And, and you would. For any of it. A chalk, a dog, or a check. My IQ has been tested at genius level, Alex, so it fucking can figure it out. And you still want to be with me? Look around, Alex. Look where we are. Do you ever think growing up in a place like this would give me a slight different perspective on death? But but if you you know all along, why didn't you just say something? (laughs) Because I didn't think it was any of my business. They're all really bad people, Alex, and they tortured and they abused everyone around them. You don't think society would be better off without them? And I mean, and as for the disposal of your remains... <laughs> That's an interesting way to put it. <laughs> listen, people, Alex, people spend millions of dollars every year on funerals, tombstones, coffins. for what? It's, I mean, it's, it is ridiculous. You figure out a way to save a lot of people a lot of money, so... You know, in a way, I admire you. Are you serious? Man, I hate this whole business. Taking advantage of people in their time of pain is horrible. Wait, but, but what about the studying and the test? I mean, isn't this like what you want to do for the rest of your life? No, it's what I have to do. What I want to do is I want to go to Paris. I want to start over. I don't want to be the freaky death girl anymore. I, I, I want to be this girl, you know, the one you know, the one who makes you tingle. You know, the one who wants you more than anything in the, in the whole world. And trust me, whatever you're thinking of doing next is the right thing. And there's gonna be no right. 